Oh, beautiful, beautiful fall day. And for all of those people in Ohio, uh, just a few more days till deer season. I got my grandfather's second gen parked out because we had to make room for this big, beautiful beast. Yes, the 12 valve, that is what I'm referring to. I'm just kidding. The Ford had to get put in the shop. It's almost completely done and ready to go. So hopefully the lighting is not too funky. We are in the cab of this young lady's new truck. So we are going to be giving her a call in just a moment here. But guys, she is getting a title in hand for a paid in full 2017 F-250 that she won by placing an order on our website, which by the way, you can also enter to win that 1998 Holy Grail 12 valve Cummins plus $5,000 cash. Get yourself entered to win that thing because it is super, super sick, super hard to find vehicle, and it's gonna make somebody a great one. We're gonna get on the phone with her, we're gonna call her, and uh, get a little bit of a reaction before she shows up here. So I'm filming this video the day before. Tomorrow morning she will be here to pick up this truck. So I wanna get a reaction on the phone, and then I wanna get a reaction in person in one condensed video and hopefully you guys enjoy this. We're gonna change up the style of the winter video just a little bit here by doing a phone call and the reveal to them in the same videos so it's not so broken up. Let's get on the phone with her and get a reaction. Hello. Hello. Hi. How are you? Has it sank in quite yet? No. <laughs> no? Well, hopefully it will tomorrow. Congratulations, by the way. How familiar are you with our brand and stuff. Did you just happen to find us through like Facebook well, or Instagram or? Uh, my boyfriend had actually from you guys like a couple years ago. Okay. And actually, I was scrolling through TikTok one day and I was like, why the heck not? I've been wanting a hat and sweatshirt because I ruined the one of the ones he gave me. Cool. So, what's your boyfriend's name? Hunter. So, you said he's heard about us for a while. Like, he kind of follows us yeah. along on stuff. And him and his buddies do. He's actually coming with me tomorrow. <laughs> awesome. Did he did he enter to win this truck also, or was it just no, you? It was just me. <laughs> Do you think there's gonna be any any hard feelings there? <laughs> no. None? <laughs> At all. <laughs> He's a Chevy guy. I have a six L power stroke right now. Okay. I, I've been wanting to get an Illuma Duty. I mean you probably I just got one of the best deals on an Illuma Duty you're probably gonna ever get, so it worked yeah. out, right? Yeah, I'm super excited. <laughs> well, congratulations again. Thanks so much for your time. All right, thank you, you too. Yep, bye. I actually forgot to have her pronounce her name properly for me on the call, and I did not address her by her name because I was about to ask her and then I totally forgot. But we'll get that in the next segment here as soon as she rolls up to pick up her truck. But um, she is from Columbus, Michigan, and like she said, she's like her boyfriend watches some of the videos and the watches on the posts on social media. He enters some of the giveaways and buys some of the products. And go figure, he doesn't enter for this one, she does and she wins the truck. How crazy is that? Anyways, that is going to be it for today. I will catch you back here tomorrow when she is arriving to pick up her new truck and her cash. I was trying to tell her about the turning radius on this thing. I was yeah. like, you do know that it's like, 
It doesn't have a very good turning radius. You're gonna have to drive it like you've got a gooseneck behind it or something. Right. <laughs> well, what's really good is it's got a gooseneck in it, so you can haul a horse trailer on it. Exactly. So How pretty is that, see? It's freaking gorgeous. Now I don't have to polish a turd anymore. <laughs> That'll look good pulling a horse trailer, right? Yeah, for sure. That's what my wife was thinking when we got this. She's like, ah, oh. she's like, I want a truck set up just like this so I can pull it to the horse shows and stuff because she's getting an amount of shooting and whatnot. Mm -hmm. I was like, yeah, well, you're going to have to find another one because we're giving this one away. I don't know. Go. It still doesn't feel real. I, oh, yeah. The key is in my hand right now. Clean and clear title. No lean. For a grand total of zero dollars and zero cents. Just in case we were to get pulled over. I know. Like wheel width yeah. violations and stuff like that. Yeah. Do you have any issues with stuff like that where you guys are? No, not really. Mm -hmm. no. no. I know in PA, where my buddy's at, he's like, it's really bad. Yeah. Like, if you have anything more than two inches outside the fender, mm -hmm. like, you either have to have flares and it has to cover the tire. Where like you get ticketed all the time. Yeah, Michigan's not terrible at all. Okay. No. But yeah, I went to school with a couple guys. They were from like PA and Connecticut okay. and Maine, and they said it's real bad up there. Yeah, even like the tent, like you would, you oh, yeah. wouldn't make it down the road. I don't mm -hmm. know. It might be that bad where you are too, but in PA, like it depends. What it's a problem. Like mainly city. Yeah. Some cer certain cities is worse. What are you thinking right now? I'm what just like amazed. <laughs> like, <laughs> so are you gonna keep the six O? You still gonna keep it as like a farm truck or? I have to pass it room. down to my brother. Okay. I mean, I would keep it, but I don't got a place for it well, at home. I guess yeah. as heartbreaking as it would be having to upgrade to 2017, <laughs> you'll manage, right? Yes, I will manage. <laughs> I mean, you know what's funny is you can't even get a new truck. I was going to order a new truck and sell her my truck. Can't even get one. It's my dad won't get rid of his King Ranch. He's actually, yeah. what year is yours? 15. Yeah, my dad's is a 13. And he's like, I would sell my truck, but he's like, what am I going to get? Mm -hmm. He said, because I would just want to get another new one. And he's right. like, I might get 45 for mine instead of 35, like it would have right. two or three years ago. But he's like, I'm also going to pay 95 to replace it. Right. Right. Like, and then you're going to wait a year. So yeah. you order, if you order a 22, you won't get it until a 23. I'm pretty excited. Well, you should be. <laughs> <laughs> it gets a lot of looks, especially around here. Like we're in a truck community, like heavy truck community. Yeah. Every time I go there, it's just packed with trucks. It's so like when you pull this in there like a couple a times, meet? everybody's like taking pictures. Like, oh, this is yeah. cool. There's a bunch of truck meets and stuff that happen yeah. around us. Actually, do you, do you know who Rut Daniels is? Rut Daniels. Like Sounds him? familiar. Well, he's going to be at the Fin Feather for today. He's a super famous, like a TikToker, like a hunter. Yeah. Okay. He does like, like funny videos. And then TikToker, okay, like, and then, yeah, that's probably where I heard him from. Yeah. So, he's going to be I mean, packed that's where today. I found you. Well, seen the video. That's yeah. Right. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Good to know it worked. Like, I always wonder what's going through people's heads when they're like winning a vehicle. You know what I mean? Like, because it's really fun to buy one. Oh, yeah. like, like, what's the feeling like? The feeling is like, like, it's just not real. It. Like, like, it doesn't feel real? No. Still? No. Friday, I was I ended up having to work late and she's blowing up my phone. I won. I was like, no, you didn't. I won. I won. Well, I just, I totally forgot. Like, I got my sweatshirt and stuff on Thursday. I was so excited. It was like, Oh my gosh. And then Jean called my phone. I was like, hello? Like, hi? Is this TM Rail Bentley? I was like, yeah. She's like, well, congratulations. You're a brand new owner of a 2017 F250. And I was like, what? <laughs> At work. I'm like, oh my gosh. You know, people are like, yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> unreal. Because I get, still to this day, I probably get 90 to 100 messages a day like, is this you? Do you have another account? And it's like requesting money. I'm like, no, do not talk to those people. Just report them. Delete mm -hmm. the thing. Move on. Okay. Yeah. And then if you want max AC. It gets pretty cold pretty quick. I mean, it's already it's already cold. And then it does have Apple CarPlay, so like if you plug your cord in down there, it will like sync with like your Apple stuff. Yeah. Which is pretty cool. Yeah. Rear drive selector. If you want to lock up the rear end, like I feel like you can burn outs or anything like that. I personally don't do that. 
Yeah. But I, I don't like getting the rubber off the freaking break fenders. It. I don't want to break anything, and then tires probably cost a lot more. Yeah, well, they do. They're they're expensive. Yeah. But if you take that knob and you pull it out, it'll actually solid lock up the rear axle, and then both will spin in sync. You shouldn't have told me that. Yeah. I was telling her if she wants to do a nasty burnout, she can just lock the rear axle, just pull the knob out, and it'll just lock it up. There you go. I said, I personally don't like scraping the rubber off the fenders, but if you wanted to. Yeah. Especially because it's white. Right? Oh. That's yeah. your job. Oh. I'm just kidding. <laughs> On the full tank, it'll get about 850, 950 cruising, about 70 miles an hour. There you go, babe. Drive everywhere, dude. This thing will last a long time on the tank. Yeah, I get like eight miles to eat. Or to get on <laughs> this actually didn't get too bad. So it, it says 16.7. That was after I brought my grandpa's truck back from Indiana. I really haven't driven it much in the last two weeks since then. Yeah. But no trailer. If you're going like 65-ish, like in the right and sweet spot, it'll get like 18 and a half. That's awesome. Like it, it's really generous. I get like generous. 16 five in my truck. Yeah. So. so it's it's pretty generous on that regard. I can't believe. I mean, I believe it now. I'm sitting in the front seat. Well, if you want to make it official, all you got to do is fill up this stuff right here. So what number is a uh, spicy tube? I don't know. No spicy tube. I never mess with the tubes. No. No, I didn't mess with them. And then it'll ask her name twice just in case there's like a co-owner. But um, if you're not sharing, then you just put down your name. <laughs> oh, no. So you did get insurance on them already? Right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Crazy man. Wanted to come out and wish you There she goes. Diesel truck giveaway. 32 in the books. Are you sad that the truck's gone? Like, you said the truck's gone, bud? Figured I'd so, come out and say hi. Even like me. Marsh. Hey. Where'd the truck go? Say bye bye. Yeah, her boyfriend. Say bye bye. Hey. Hey. He's pooping. <laughs> no, I was just letting you know. Anyways, <laughs> and we're live. Well, everybody, that is going to put a wrap on the giveaway for that Ford. The giveaway ended on September 6th. She got her truck on September 20th. That's about how much time it usually takes to get in touch with a winner. Seven to 14 days after a giveaway is over, which, by the way, this giveaway ends on October 23rd. And right now, every $1 gets you 30 entries towards winning this 1998 quad cab short bed, five speed, four wheel drive, 12 outcomes, plus $5,000 in cash. Thank you guys so much for watching and supporting the brand. We really appreciate it. I'll catch you in the next video.